Uh, I'm Steve Sinclair, I'm creative director at Digital Extremes, and I work on Warframe that we're showing on PlayStation 4. So tell us about Warframe, what is it? Warframe is a uh, Space Ninja game. Uh, you, you either solo or with your friends, you join up and you go through boss raids, assassination missions, uh, in this kind of MMO light persistent world. All your gear, all your Warframes, which is your power armor, all your melee weapons, your swords, your axes, all that stuff levels up as you play and you find upgrades in the world and you customize your gear, uh, you, you're, you are uh, you can join a clan and build a dojo in space. Uh, so it, we get a lot of players who compare the game to Mass Effect 3 multiplayer meets Ninja Gaiden. Uh, or uh, a lot of players also who, who love the Fantasy Star Online series and see a lot of similarities in Warframe. So what has making a game on the next-gen consoles opened up for you creatively and technologically? Right. Well, I think, uh, you know, when we uh, were doing our PC open beta, uh, and it was going really well, and we were showing up in the top 10 of Steam, uh, Sony contacted us like, hey, what would you think about bringing Warframe to next-gen console, PlayStation 4? And you know, we were a little concerned about uh, how updating would work, because Warframe is a game that we're trying to constantly grow. So, <laughs> for the rapper just walked by. Um, so, you know, we said, we'd love to try it. Send us dev kits, we'll see, we'll see what we can do. And here we are, three months later, showing the game in Sony's booth with our trailer on the 200-foot wraparound screens. It's been absolutely incredible for us as an independent developer, Sony's willingness to work with us for our PlayStation 4. Uh, as far as the hardware, it's a dream to develop for. Uh, the fact that we've been able to show it here at 1080p running amazingly after only three months of development shows how awesome this new console is, is going to be to work for. Um, but also the change in attitude uh, about how working with independence and also how the games can be updated more. Typically we see DLC as the way that people have got updates for games, but that doesn't work for Warframe. Warframe is constantly growing and evolving uh, with weekly events and monthly additions to the game. So we're really excited about that sort of new attitude and how that's gonna work for our game. What are some of the challenges when moving over, because you were building on a PC platform, to the next gen consoles? The challenges are, well, the hardware's really kick ass, but uh, controls are, are some of the biggest challenges uh, and the obstacles that we thought we'd face in terms of how updating a certification was going to work, a lot of those fears have been alleviated. So now it's just coming down to taking advantage of the, the console specific features, the share button, uh, the touchpad interface. Those are things that we're experimenting with now and we have gestures now to use the Warframe powers. Uh, a lot of the challenges, I think, are going to be around making the controls feel really awesome for a game that started on PC. So when is Warframe coming out? Warframe is coming out for the launch, day one when PlayStation 4 comes out, which I don't think they've announced yet, but they said this fall.